When you think about ping pong, you may not think about fighting. But actually, playing ping pong can help you with your boxing abilities. You know, in Soviet Union, every boxing gym, they have ping pong table in Why? the gym. To help you with To this? help you with coordination. Both disciplines are about interpreting information as quickly as possible to act according to the situation. Have you ever noticed that the highest level table tennis players always seem to know where the ball is going to go? This is because they process information even before their opponent hits the ball. This way they're able to come up with accurate guesses almost every time. Timing and body posture are things professional players look for when trying to predict the placement of their opponent's shots. All of this happens in a matter of milliseconds. This is the same reason why boxers can dodge and counterpunch. They can read what punch is coming at them from the moment their opponent lets their hands go. Once they read their opponent's punch, their muscle memory takes over to counter. Jake Paul has a upcoming boxing match coming up, and he played a little bit of ping pong and was very enthusiastic about it. But to the everyday person, this may just seem like him playing a game, but it's actually helping him with his boxing. Yo, I got winning. Gus, you're too buff to play ping pong, bro. Wait, let me put my sleeves up. <laughs> nah, you're too buff, bro. <laughs> I mean, Jake Paul is really cracking those uh, ping pong balls. Also, I mean, is there any correlation between him being good at ping pong and him boxing, you know, and having success in boxing, I should say? I'll let you guys answer that in the comments below. Something to think about. That's it for this one, and I'll see you guys on the next one.